because if I do, he catch a little mouse and I'll eat it. So it's always a good policy to block below the elbow towards the inside. Now, I'm just merely going to see this little torque the other way where he throws that left. Boom! You notice? It's short. And I don't receive or go past my shoulders. So he's going to throw right left. Boom! Boom! Now, I'm not going to lose contact. I'm going to slide. And then I'm going to pencil it. I'm going to set myself. You notice what I did with my foot? I did not stop it. I kicked his foot and then hit it. A lot of guys would go this, but it doesn't make sense. So when I go his, bam! Now he'd be slurpy suit too strong. He has a buddy, and I go, wow! And I cross over, and I said, there's more of this where that came from. Right? But well, what did I do? I didn't even look at him, because I already know and the thing shot there, did I watch hit that throat? No, I didn't, because I properly aligned his body in the obscure elbow. So we're going right, left, drop the hammer, semi-circle, catch him with an obscure, just pop the chin a little bit. People say, why do you put your hand there? Why? Everybody. You can do a block. Guard. Block, guard, good, good. What else? Yeah. I poke. Right. I poke, and if he throws that right hook, whoa, now I have more fun. I do, boom, boom, boom. Now I'm just tearing him up. Boom, that, boom. And I, I'm hitting him between the arc rugs, so all those wasted money for lessons that I want to make sure it's working out while the time. So I crank him up in the knee and catch him up there, straighten him up a little bit. A lot of guys say, you hit him with an uppercut elbow. But always come back with a claw, always come back with a dropping elbow. If you catch here, you can come around and trap and break the knee jobbing. We call it a knee job at home. Actually, when the guy's on the ground, we call it a shoot job. So we gotta go one, two, three, four, five. We can step away, side kick, cross the cover. We'll keep it right in that range before we explore the other realms of the self-defense move. Any questions? Who'd like to see it again? Are you a fan? Okay. So right left. One. Boom. Straight. Boom. Move away. Fire. And then cross over and cover. Any questions? Go to work, thank you. Now we're gonna do what we call, he throws that right hook, boom, left, boom, hit, boom, hit, boom, hit, boom. Everybody sees that, he's throwing that wild hook. Boom, now we go, bam, 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 Okay, so, when I'm here, since I just did obscure, hammer, Obscure, all I do is circle around and I go like this. You guys got that all right? Yeah. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> not taking these beatings for nothing. Okay? Some guys like to do a knuckle drag. They just wham! And then they go with a chop or a tiger. So if you feel comfortable, just like, boom, bam! That's good too. But I just do here, break, hammer. Okay? So everybody knows, I go right, left, boom, boom, bam, bam, boom, go back, boom, 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 and you can cover. Okay. Got it? Yes, sir. Go to work. Thank you. Yes, bam! Or, big deep guys would throw the hammer, and what are they getting? Right. So if I go here, the next step to this is you roll this around and you break. See there? We go one, two, roll, and break. Go work.